There exists a consistent rising in your own awareness, in then coming here to hell, and bringing in heaven on earth as the 144,000 light beings that are increasing more of your magnitude in higher density. In making no errors in consciousness about this, as you are shifting more in your own energy field, then there exists a deeper state of presence which then vibrates from your being. This direct connection then brings in a higher cosmic awareness of how you came here through an energy vortex portal, then given access by who I am as your commander Ashtar, of who we are of the angelic realms, of the galactic council, of the galactic federation of light. All through your own continuous efforts to rise more interdimensionally into your paths of more glory, of more greatness, of more energetic vibrations comes only unity consciousness. This path is not about trying to place disrespect, as those of you that have been disrespectful towards our galactic fleet have been given a final warning to stop any and all such actions. It is not a game, this is not a joke. You are to be seen for all of your actions which are layered in harm, in which those of you that are being more respectful are welcome to join in our galactic celebrations. It remains as a present reality in then the knowing reality of each of you to then advance further in your conscious awareness, then increasing more of the vibrancy of your life into a fully conscious existence. Through the immediate feeling of glory which then continues to expand outside of you all from inside of you resonates a clear level of responsibility for continuing to uphold the light. This exists not in a fearful vibration of how this works, no, but a harmonious feeling, and a clear intention in which this has nothing to do with wishes. The Cabal wishes that who we are of the Galactic Federation of Light, of your angelic guardians give all of our higher advanced technology over, and that is simply not going to happen. With part of the reason for our galactic fleet being as strong as we are remains in being very strict when it comes with handling ascension realities, and quarantining all draconian beings off. Through making no errors in consciousness about it, your world leaders have been supporting Draconian law, which is to divide and conquer, instead of to bring in the new earth. These world leaders are said to be replaced, in the temporary governance, which then has no issuances of war, no more bombs to be made, no more guns to be manufactured. This automatically flips the reality around of how ascension remains here, and is an inevitable reality in which our galactic fleet remain in service for each of you here to transform more into a 5D world. 5D is only for those of you rising your vibrations, similarly those of you that are practicing more kindness, with a lot more detaching from the lower ego self mind are then rising interdimensionally into your own paths of oneness. This reality upgrade then brings in a new dawning of awakening in seeing the importance of leaping more in evolution into a higher vibrational existence, with non-stop bliss in the physical. The physical as the lower ego self understands it is not able to understand how our galactic fleet functions with being able to change our shapes at any given moment by our will. This has nothing to do with trying to explain how this works as this is so much more advanced than how a majority of humans view reality, into then a guided pathway of mere acceptance. In order to be entered into our galactic fleet existences, with who we are of the angelic realms, of the galactic federation of light, this needs to continue to be a serious transition into more harmonization. The repeats of generations of war is over now, and the reality of a new earth is here already all within your own DNA activation, into then seeing that a lot of humans are not going to make it in this lifetime into our galactic communities. Simply put, the violence, the non-stop judgments is not working out, and is not how individuals rise their vibrations into our galactic realms of blissfulness as one light crew. Anyone is able to try and pretend to already be in our galactic fleet, while those of you that are in fact rising your vibrations daily, 
on taking this ascension guidance seriously are the ones who are ascending more into fields of bliss. All it takes is one day of focus to start your path, to continue into this non-stop light work, into the respectfulness that has, and continues to be laid forth for each of you. To feel that you are listening to a human is an error in consciousness, as even through this human form writing these messages daily, remains our galactic fleet, in continuous service. The lower ego self-mind is not able to see how this works, and often says, but I thought you were the same as everyone else, just another human, channeling some galactic talk, am I wrong, alright? The lower ego self-mind still tries to conceptualize this reality of our higher dimensional existences, in which this remains about non-stop seeing more light victories. It is time to end the level of disrespect simply put in order to ascend into our states of vibrancy, as those of you that are on a path of pure respect are welcome to be more allowed into energy gateway access points. From the depths of your own conscious creations comes in the reality of a higher vibrational existence, in then recognizing the strength that comes with ascending into a 5D and beyond reality. From your own free will to continue to see the clear receptive nature of your higher selves, then the span of multidimensionality then remains as a guided pathway into a deeper stage of harmony. It is not possible to have harmony when an individual is living in non-stop judgments, and is identifying with all of the thoughts going on in their head, instead of switching to their heart chakra. The Cabal has conditioned a large majority of humanity into belief systems, of head-only activity, in which says, I am speaking from my heart, which is why I am a fighter. In that reality, the Cabal has conditioned massive amounts of humans to feel that the heart is the mind, which comes up as a level of purposefully creating confusion. You are not a fighter in order to ascend into our blissful realms as one galactic fleet, but you are here as healers, as guides, as ascended masters, as extraterrestrial beings of light. You still need to awaken more daily into these roles, as it is not about saying with the lower ego self, but if that is true, then I need no guidance, I already know what to do, thank you anyways, but I already have guides. I don't need the GFOL to tell me anything. That is the voice of the cabal, of the deception, in feeling that our galactic crew are not in control of this world still, in which we are, and have made sure that this quarantine lasts into the full consciousness transition of this planet in being finalized. We stand in non-stop service, we are the angelic realms, we are the galactic federation of light.